Welcome to TNC Flipbook. Now I will talk about creating your first flipbook in TNC Flipbook PDF Viewer for WordPress. There are two methods. Here I will talk about the method 1 Upload and Publish. To upload and publish your first PDF viewer, go to TNC Flipbook and then add new. Set a title let's say TNC Test. Now upload the PDF of your choice. Like I uploaded many PDFs earlier, and now I am selecting one of those PDFs, and then click Select. OK after that now there are various options like default scrolling mode. There are four types of scrolling mode vertical, horizontal, wrapped, and flip. If you want to scroll vertically or horizontally pick these two or if you want to scroll as wrapped you can select wrapped. Or you want to change the page as a flipbook select flip. I'm selecting the flip. Default spread. You can select default spread odd or even. I am selecting even. Default zoom. You can select default zoom like page fit, page height, page width and any of your choice. Page mode. The page mode can be bookmark, thumbnail or attachment. You can keep it as it is. Jump to page. You can put as a number where the PDF will start, as I want to start it from page number 2 so I am selecting 2. Choose icon size. You can choose small, medium or large size as per your need. Select toolbar style. You can select various toolbar style from here, like top full width, bottom full width, top center, bottom center. Viewer language. Here are more than hundreds of language for select. The default is English US. So I am keeping the language as English US. Return to site link. You can put a link in the return to site link. There is a button in the right bottom where the link will work. If you keep it as blank, it will return to the previous page. The next option is toolbar element. If you want to customize this. You need to turn the global settings off. By default this option is enable. Have a look here. These are the toolbar elements. Download, print, full screen, zoom and many more. You can turn this off or on. You can customize this toolbar elements as per your needs. Then we will move on to the appearance tab. You can customize the appearance of your flipbook from here. You can turn the global settings off to customize it or you can use the global settings. If you want to use a theme or custom colors, you can select it from here. Select theme. You can select themes from here, like aqua white, material blue, midnight calm, Lewis purple, or sea green. Choose any of these options to match your own. The next option is the logo. You can select your logo from here. Simply click upload logo and upload your logo from your media library. And this logo will be placed on top of your flipbook. Favicon. You can select and upload your favicon for viewer pages from here. Use background image. You can select and upload your background image for viewer pages. You can also select the background size from here. There are many options. Select any of these you like. Then background repeat. Here is also many options. Select any of these you like. Background attachment. You can also select background attachment from here. Background position. You can use the keywords to specify the horizontal and vertical position separately. Now let's talk about privacy and security tab. If you want to protect your specific PDF file, you need to install a plugin which is WP File Access Manager. It can help you protect every PDF file on your website. You can set permissions for each PDF file by user, user role, user login status. It is also compatible with WooCommerce and Paid Membership Pro plugins. Okay, now let's talk about the error heading. The default error title is, sorry, you can change it. Here, I write, try again. Error content. As with the error heading, you can set a message or leave it as the default text. Next is error button text. You can set your error button text from here. Error button URL. Also you can set your error button URL from here. After completing all these settings click publish and your PDF viewer is created successfully. Now let's test our recently created PDF viewer. 
you can see how smooth the flipbook works and its performance as well. So this way you can create your PDF viewer by uploading the PDF. Hope everyone likes it. Subscribe to our official YouTube channel, and thanks for watching.